Hi everybody, welcome to our July newsletter and we're experiencing our first heat wave, which made it's us getting think, hot out. Yeah. Made us think about climate change and emissions. Yes. Um, as many of you know, a couple years ago, Local Law 97 was passed, which was a, a very ambitious and uh, aspirational proposal for all buildings to have no carbon footprint by 2050. Uh, and it's, it's oftentimes when you walk around the city, why you're seeing different uh, grades on buildings. Um, one more thing to, for, for people to, you know, judge themselves by and their buildings by. Uh, and, and we are starting to see some backtracking. Yeah, I think the interesting thing about climate policy that we've experienced in the last decade really is the policy can look good on paper but implementation yes. of a policy can be very, very difficult. And that is definitely the case with Local Law 97. Now we're seeing politicians realizing that the implementation of Local Law 97 is not only incredibly difficult uh, logistically for buildings, but it's also really expensive. So the latest we're seeing is a workaround to allow buildings to include any kind of outdoor space in their uh, lot tax lot that would go kind of against the calculation of emissions, allowing them to kind of bring their emissions up maybe a little bit so yeah. that the implementation of 97 isn't as difficult and as expensive. And so I think we're starting to see more and more things like that. We just experienced it with congestion pricing. Yeah. I, I mean, I think in theory, a, a lot of these ideas, they're in the right place. And right. I understand if things get bogged down for too long, there's no progress and no one is pushing the needle forward. Yep. Um, so I think I appreciate it, but 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 really, you know, the city is a big, complex, dense place. Uh, you know, not just in Manhattan, but but in all of the boroughs. Yeah. And it is really hard to to implement sweeping legislation like that. Um, yeah, I and, think I think that's that's the right point. Yeah is that sweeping legislation just across the board, everyone's gonna have zero emissions by 2050 is just not realistic in, yeah. in its spirit. And there has to be the localities and the different types of buildings taken into account. So yeah. we'll see what happens next, but um, you know, it's an interesting uh, policy shift in just the last couple of weeks between walking back congestion pricing and now somewhat walking back the local law 97 implementation so yeah it's an ever evolving landscape yeah absolutely thanks everybody for uh watching us this month and we will see you soon take care